I'm Howard Tolman. I'm the CEO of 1871. I started in January of this year. And uh, since that time, one of the first things we did was announce our first uh, departing cohort of companies. When companies get to a certain size, they want a little more private space, a little more um, security around what they're doing. So one of the things we're uh, about to announce is that we'll be expanding to another 25,000 square feet next to 1871. And one of the things that will be in there are some offices for our alumni. So we're very excited to uh, be doing that. Also, in that new space will be a series of incubators around different areas where we think now that we have concentrations of enough companies in edtech, in femtech, in fintech, in real estate, food, and internet of things to have a critical mass. So we want to bring those companies together. It's going to be a very collaborative and additive environment if we can pull that off. Some are here and some will be recruited in those areas. We think that once they're aware that this is sort of a place where additional resources, special programming, and other tools and things will be made available that are particularly focused on their areas of interest that will attract more companies. Uh, for example, we don't have a huge number of companies in the fintech area, but this is another major initiative of the mayors, and so that's one of the things that we're going to want to focus on. So that's financial technology, financial transactions. You know, Chicago and London are probably the two primary places for all kinds of different uh, financial instruments, financial exchanges, financial uh, dealings, and so there's a tremendous amount of innovation going on. In fact, I can't think of an industry other than media that's under more pressure than traditional banking, particularly because you've got new cryptocurrencies, you've got new payment schemes, you've got Facebook announcing they're going to be in the payment business. You have Apple with 600 million credit cards on file. So there's tremendous opportunities for innovation, for disruptive technology. We definitely think Chicago can be a major player in that space, and with the CME and all these other organizations here, we're very excited about that prospect.